I'm tempted. Don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> the call of the void. Welcome back, goblins and goblets and Balatro enjoyers. It's Super Nellias with another Balatro video. Today we will be attempting a ghost deck run as uh, the community has voted as ghost deck is the second deck of the four that I optioned out in the community post. So thank you guys for voting on that. Uh, as uh, you know, as I've been doing with all these other deck runs, I want to kind of go over what the ghost deck is. It's, uh, it's, it's honestly, it doesn't play much differently than like a red or blue deck. Um, the only difference is that now spectral cards may appear in the shop you start with a hex card the benefit of which means you can turn a kind of okay um joker into a polychrome joker and with the polychrome joker you're gonna get a little bit of additional malt uh early off uh, so without further ado let's get into the video but with a little further ado thank you guys for watching if you like my content do the engagement stuff like subscribe leave a comment it helps me out it helps me know that you guys are enjoying this stuff and what i can work on etc etc um, and I just want to thank you for all watching this series. All right, let's get into it. So uh, there you can see we start with a polychrome. Um, I don't think we're going to skip because there's no point in polychroming another joker. Um, that's already polychrome. Uh, and the, the thing with the hex card is that although it adds polychrome, it will destroy all your other jokers. So you don't want to use this late in the game you actually want to use it as early as possible that way you're not maybe ruining a joker you want to keep but we'll start with the small blind and we got a full house right there that might be enough to get us 300 points yes yes it is beautiful beautiful i had no idea where this build is going to take us today uh sorry if i'm a little quiet or my voice is a little tired. Oh, Ride the Buck is really, 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 really good. Um, scaling Jokers, especially at higher stake difficulties, are really good to get early on. So I am going to take Ride the Bus. I am also going to Polychrome it. And then what we want to do is we want to just play like small hands. We want to avoid our face cards. This is really giving us a direction to go. Um, I like it. And so, yeah, we'll jump back in. We'll do the big blind because we want to play as many hands as possible. Um, there is a pair. Uh, you can, so the thing with ride the bus is you can play base cards so long as they're not scored. So in the case of like this and this, I can play it. I'm not gonna, it's not gonna impede ride the bus. So it's, a, it's just a pair. But if I had something like Splash or Parad Paradoilia or whatever it's called, um, that would actually be a bad news bears for us do for oh we do have a straight potential so um yeah but like again we just want to kind of like play our cards see what happens got another two pair and there you go see so it, it's building up um it's a little slow but as it starts to build up because it's also polychrome it's going to start multiplying its own mult so it's a really it's a really good card to get um and with banner these two cards kind of go hand in hand um so as long as i'm not discarding and i'm playing small hands like high card pair etc this is going to go well together so i think this is a good starting build all right perfect and i'm already seeing we got three of a kind so I'm just gonna throw that out like there. See what we get. Oh my god, look at that. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're just gonna no face cards. No face cards. Um, do I wanna buy anything right now? I don't think I do. Like an Emperor card wouldn't be bad, but it's not useful for us. Um and the same thing with a celestial pack is probably gonna only go with like these three hands right here maybe three of a kind if we're lucky with our own, like more hands we the, the big thing is we don't want to be discarding and we don't want to be uh playing base cards so i could have i probably could have done uh, just high cards here and that would have been a little bit better because again kind of the, the the power behind ride the bus is you want to stay 
you want to stay in uh what you call it you want to you want to stay in the the hands for as long as you want because i got four hands that's four opportunities to level up ride the bus never mind <laughs> even a high card too i don't know what i'm talking about anymore apparently um obviously as as the score scales that's gonna change i will take two pair will occasionally uh you know it's it's common enough opening hand uh, and i will take a celestial pack let's do high card just to get a little bit more value on it um and yeah all face cards are drawn face down oh that makes this build really easy as i'll just play I'll play it too as a high card It's still too good. Oh my goodness. I thought I'd have at least like two. Um, for now, Gross Michelle would be really good. Uh, just to get that flat malt. Um, but yeah, this is carrying. Again, we want to play as many hands as possible. Um, but Gross Michelle. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> that doesn't matter. Um, but the reason I pick up Rose Michelle is so that eventually it's going to go extinct and we are going to, you know, get something else. Mm -hmm. I just think we'll just go next round. We can build up our money. Now the Psychic is going to be an issue coming up. I can see it. Oh, and there it is. So that's, that's what we want. We want Gross Michelle to die. Um... That opens up the opportunities for us to find Cavendish in an opening hand. It will buy your Uranus or Uranus. I don't know what the actual appropriate spelling or pronunciation of that planet is, but uh, yeah, we all know it's <laughs> Uranus, Uranus uh, from the playground. I'm trying not to be crude on this channel. Now on my Twitch streams, on the other hand, yeah, we have room for being crude. Uh, I will only use an Emperor card because I just like. Yeah, let's see what we get. Because my understanding is Judgment can make any Joker outside of Legendary Joker, so I can make it a common, an uncommon, or a rare. Um, which is... Damn, that's pretty useful. <laughs> Speak of the devil. Um, that was a really useful Joker to get. Um, but because right now our money is over 25, I think, I think I'm just going to kind of keep it. Uh, let's go foil, holographic, and polygram cards more appear, appear more. No way, yeah. We got the money. As long as your money's over 25, um, you're always going to be making maximum interest. Uh, unless you get the uh, vouchers that increase uh, the the interest thresholds. So, but because I don't have those right now, there's no point. Uh, what am I going to do? I'm going to play a card. Or pair. We want to beat the score. So now that we have Constellation, we do want to also be looking for any Constellation card. It doesn't matter what Constellation card is as long as we're playing it, because that's going to increase the malt. So we've got some good value. This is still going up. As long as we don't do any misplays, uh, we can get Ride the Bus up really high. Uh, to do double our money. You know what? Buy it. Yeah that can actually help remove base cards like we can turn kings into aces thinning out our base cards and we're absolutely gonna buy seed money this raises the cap on interest earned so that means that we'll want to have fifty dollars banked up uh but i can use that money and then absolutely celestial pack you need to go for it um let's level up a pair we haven't done any work with a pair, so let's level it up. Uh, and then, you know, let's see what we get in the jumbo pack. Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah, so in a case like this, uh, I'm going to use this. The thought process being is that, again, we're getting rid of base cards. Slowly, we, I know we have less queens, but we have more kings, and more kings means we can turn them into aces. But the reason I took High Priestess is so that we can get Constellation to more malt. So I think what we want is like Cavendish and then another multiplier. Something like Hard Sharp or even Ramen. Ramen's gonna work really well because with Banner we're not discarding. Um, 
So yeah, if, if those come up, we might want to skip for a negative Joker. We'll see. So let's see. Let's go in. Let's get that blind. We're also going to get more. We're going to get, I think, seven. Yeah. We'd almost get eight if we had more money, but we are not. Um, do I want to play this? Ah. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> let's see what three of a kind does. Now, this is base level three of a kind. It's not bad. I'm tempted. Don't. Do it. <laughs> the call of the void. Uh, I know I technically don't need to play those, so I can do something like that just to again thin out. And yeah, so we're scoring pretty well. Um, like I said, and there you go. Seven interest. We're now at fifty. Um, honestly, outside of erosion, wouldn't be bad either because if we start the leading cards that's pretty good um yeah let's open a jumbo pack it's more malt and then in something like this you know how i'm feeling about high card usage so let's get high card to the moon and let's go next round um so here's the thing if the arm is going to decrease the level of the played poker hand is it worth a negative joker i think it is this is maybe a little zany. I think we're okay. We have four hands. We can play high card or pair. Two pair. Get rid of that Joker, or not Joker, Jack. Not too bad. We have a straight. Do not play the straight. Uh, I'm going to, yeah, let's lower the pair. I'd rather lower the pair a little bit. There we go. We got through it. Not too bad. We're going to get $9 in interest. $5 from the boss. To, oh, wow. Really, really raking in the dough. Okay. If you've been watching these videos, you know how I feel about Ceremonial Dagger. It's, it is a favorite of mine, so I am going to buy it. Uh, I'm going to buy it and use that. And... Because it's a planet card. So now we're gotten 1.5, 1.5. If we can get this fed, anything, we're going to start getting some real good malt. Now it is meaning that I need to pay attention to my positioning. <laughs> um... Destroy tarot cards. Oh! Uh, or money money's better i think money's the bigger play right now uh perfect and then again more money more money <laughs> uh i think we were still over 50 so we're gonna get max um what i'm gonna do is let's convert that get rid of these uh base cards so we just have less less likelihood of screwing things over um, uh, yeah, let's just go. Let's go in. Uh, I'm not gonna skip. It was gonna give us maybe a Mega Celestial pack. Yeah. I can see myself doing that. Play that. So we're, we're not gonna have anything for Ceremonial Dagger, but we are gonna basically start just buying junk to feed it, so to speak. Uh, because this increases its malt based off the sell value of cards, so... Um, although they won't be junk cards, I am going to just beat them. So, this is an uncommon, I know it's going to add a stone card, but I think this will trigger before it adds a stone card. Correct me if I'm wrong, but we'll find out shortly. Um, and let's level up uh, pair again. So as you can see, now constellations, yeah, it's going to go. What we're really looking for is like high priestess cards. I'm never going to play flush. Just, I'm just probably not. So I'm not going to skip. Let's see what happens. It ate it first. Okay. And now that we've got it, if we do want to move it here. It's got a little bit of malt. Um, do do. We could play high card. I'm just going to play high card. Do what we get. 
10,000 off buy card on a pair. Let's see what we get. Well, we beat, we beat the big blind, so. Ooh, yeah. Things are looking good. I am not too concerned. Um, again, we're playing on white stake difficulty. Um, so, Ankh creates a copy of a random joker and it destroys all other jokers. So, it's, it's really good if you wanted to maybe duplicate something early. Uh, but, in this case, not worth it. I don't think it's worth it. So I'm just going to do a Celestial Pack. Also, because we're in the shop, let's move this back. We don't, we do not want Ceremonial Dagger eating Ride the Bus. <laughs> like, do not do that. Um, I could, I could buy this just for the, uh, the malt. We'll open up another Arcana Pack. Um, so yeah, and in this case, we don't want to go below... Fifty dollars. Uh, I could try. Hope that maybe we get something. You know what? Um, I'm gonna buy it, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna let this eat over the next couple of. Now it's a ten malt. There's gonna be ten times one point five times one point seven, and as you can see, it starts to uh, it starts to, to go. Uh, you know what? Let's play a pair and see see where we're at. Fourteen thousand. Um, that's not bad. And then six, five, four, three, two. You got a straight. I'm gonna play it because why the heck not? And we also still have room for a, another Joker. already on anti-6 so things are going pretty well $16 uh, gives us lots of money I'm gonna move that there I'm gonna buy fine use it's again we just want to level up constellation I do not care the celestial packs aren't really worth it you're paying $6 when so I'm going to buy this instead. I think $4 is a better investment. Let's go. Now that I see the ox is coming up, we don't want to play a pair. Uh, I wonder if... It, I wonder if the ox will change if I play a bunch of high cards before I get to it. Let's keep an eye on that. So even a high card got us twenty thousand. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. yeah, let's open a uh, buffoon pack. See if we get anything good. Um, this is rare, so it's gonna actually have a higher sell value. Um, so I think, I think yes, we eat it. Uh, um, and then I know, I know we don't want hey a pair, but don't want to level up a pair. I want to level up hands that are actually gonna be most likely to be used let's go so now it's a tumult um i'm just gonna play with high card see what happens Twenty-one thousand. we're gonna play another high card move the ceremonial dagger back um, I was doing a run. I had like the perfect ceremonial dagger build. I had the egg. It was really leveled up. And then um, <laughs> I forgot to move it back. And it was just devastating. I do have it recorded. Um, so I, I planned to. Um, it was from a stream. Uh, I'm just very, very upset with myself about it. Uh, but it's funny. It's always funny. It's always funny when it happens. Ah, uh, yeah, Temperance card, get more money. Because more money means we can do more shenanigans. I will buy this. Um, yeah, you know what? I don't care. The plus two hand size with the minus one hands per round doesn't really affect me too much. 
I will buy that. We can maybe get rid of some more face cards. Um, and yeah, and we just won't play a pair. Oh no, what will we do? We will not play a pair. Um, use the hangman on. You know what? No. Don't want to set our money down to zero, so we're just going to play high cards for a little bit. Oh, we got a 10. That's going to trigger this. So let's maybe move that there. I don't know if, again, yeah, it's positioning doesn't matter because it, it triggers based off the card played. <laughs> so we keep our money intact. Things are going pretty well. Uh, absolutely. Always buy clearance sale. Buy clearance sale. Buy, buy it. It's a recommended. Um, and then I got two celestial packs. So I'm going to level up air. We'll also level up... Uh, we have a kind just because it's there. Getting more malt for that. Uh, do, 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 do. You know what? Just buy it. We got the money. And we're gonna go. We're gonna eat. Uh, do, do. Let's see what one high card 10 does for us. I didn't delete those kings because I do want to convert them to aces, ideally. Ooh. That's actually really good with Ceremonial Dagger. Um, yeah. We're going to say bye-bye. Uh, actually, you know what we can do? I got some thoughts. I got some thoughts and feelings. Um, There's a High Priestess card. I wish we had a strength card. We do not. Uh, so I, just, I guess I'm just going to do Hangman. Lead the Kings. And we're going to use High Priestess. Get more planet cards. Sorry, my brain is just keep leveling that up. Because more malt brings more value out of that, right? Um, and then we're just going to go next round. We're not going to eat anything yet. Because we want to increase the... Uh, sell value the end of a round so now we can do something like oh I'm gonna play high card and we're just gonna keep playing high card to trigger uh, ride the bus two high cards should get us through the round really not worried right so now this is, was worth two Maybe I'm wrong. Ooh, I do like that. Um, earn an extra dollar of interest is going to give us more money. Still yet to have the mat, like, hit the $400 threshold. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy that. And I'm going to go here. I'm going to buy this. I'm bringing you all the way over here because I don't want you to eat it. This is supposed to have everything should go up in itself. Uh, let's re-roll. Let's see what we get. Strength want that i want that on deck uh, all right let's do that so i can just convert more kings oh beautiful that was the play so now if we look at our deck how many face cards do we have we only have seven face cards beautiful we'd love to see it um we're gonna bring you over here you're going to yeah, so everything is i just checked in values five three two Three. Wouldn't it be really great? Uh, it'd be really great uh, if I got um egg. <laughs> I'm just never gonna stop talking about egg. Um, yeah, beautiful. Again, I don't care. We're just playing high card. We're trying to level up, ride the bus. So we're not having any difficulty. So this is now four dollars, four, six, six. Four, three. There's our. Earn an extra dollar of interest for every five dollars you have at the end of the round. All right. <laughs> um. 
That is amazing. I don't think this is going to go infinite. Um, again, we're just leveling up anything. We do not care. For $4. Um, yeah, I think, I think we just go. Like, I, I could. I could. You know what? Let's do, let's do one more so this goes to 40. Uh, one random joker disabled every hand. That's not bad because we got a couple jokers that actually don't do anything for us. Um, so the, the odds are it might hit something we don't care about. Let's just go, let's play an ace. And play a two. I almost played the king thinking it was going to be, I don't know, something. This build, this move, uh, this might be the first video where I do take us into Endless to see if we can get money. <laughs> uh, this is antithetical to our build. We will never take it. But we'll take a Jumbo Celestial pack and level up a pair. But yeah, I, I think I think this build's going pretty well. Uh, I'll do a reroll real quick to see what we get. Uh, do, do, do. Everything is You know what? Yeah, we don't we don't want to um give the dollar per unused discard. But that would give us a lot of money. Um if you're trying to get that four hundred dollars so that you can have um what you call it? I think you know what? I think we do it, and I think we it's time we eat it. It's 40 malt. Um do 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 just play an ace and see what we get. How much for a pair? That's pretty good. Um, I will open a Jumbo Buffoon pack. We're just looking for anything that... Ooh, lose all discards. So the problem with Burglar is that it actually is like works opposite against Banner. Um, it would remove all our discards and then Banner is going to give us less chips. So I'm just going to do that. I'm opening all these Buffoon packs to see if we can maybe get an another negative. Um... That is a bit of a call of the void for me. I am seeing madness. It's like that would give us just a bunch of malt, but the problem is it will probably eat stuff that we don't want. Madness is really good when you're playing on higher stakes because you actually will get eternal jokers, which cannot be deleted. So if something like this would try to delete an eternal joker, or if you have all eternal jokers, it just won't delete anything and it'll just still keep increasing its malt because although it actually gets malt when blind is selected it doesn't get malt when a random joker is destroyed it's just more of an, an additional effect right because it says when blind is selected gain 0.5x malt and destroy a random joker so it, it gives you two effects when you select blind um immolate destroys five cards in hand gives you 20 bucks you'll love to see it this yeah paradoilia don't take paradoilia with ride the bus I did it for a meme video one time. You can see it on my channel. <laughs> it's pure chaos. Um, do, 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 do. Uh, do I reroll? No. Let's just, let's keep going. Um, so one random joker disabled every hand. Uh, there's a chance that it might hit something like this, so I'm not worried. Actually, you know what? Just to increase our odds. That way, if it hits raised fist, we don't care because raised fist isn't going to give us a lot of malt. So it is not ah, perfect. There you go. Um, and I can do something like hair. Oh no, it hit constellation. That's not great, but it's also not bad. Um, other way around. 
to do high card. Uh, that way we get at least a little bit more malt and it's going to be multiplied by 1.5. I think we'll still hit like 30k. Um, I could be wrong. Let's find out. So I think I think I will take this into endless mode, just because I want to see kind of how far we can take it. Um, again, celestial packs are we want them. We don't care what's in them. I bird, yep. You know me, baby. Do 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 do. Yeah, absolutely, Pluto. Um, and then. Planet Merchant's going to be really valuable for us because of that. So 100, 110k, that's not going to be hard. I think we can do it. Just do a high card. Seventy-five. Do another high card. Another seventy-five. Seventy-six. Ooh, because <laughs> then the malt went up on that. Um. So yeah, that is, so, um, buy it. Actually, you know what? Buy that because it's going to be worth more. Do, do, do. I was surprised it's actually not worth more at being an uncommon. Um, yeah, let's just go next round. Uh, play only one hand. Now that actually might be an issue because we technically kind of need to play two hands. Um, so if we're going to play one hand, we want to play a pair. Or maybe a three of a kind, if we're lucky. Um, so we actually might get screwed by the needle. I was not expecting the needle. Um, let's just see what a three of a kind gets us. We've leveled it up a bit. Okay, so a three of a kind will get us through the needle. What about a pair? I see that three of a kind of jacks right there. Staring me in the face. I don't know if that was enough. We need more. We need more malt. so perfect so that's gonna get eight but it did go up in cell value um i'll use that just in case again uh planet cards are gonna be very valuable splash would also be very antithetical to our build um i'm just trying to prep for the needle so find some cards like that i think we should be able to get i think we should be able to do it uh we have no pairs we have nine, eight, seven, six, five. That is a straight. It's crazy that our high card is now more valuable than a straight. Um, I think what I do is I go boom, boom. We do high card aces. And we just hope this is enough. I'm not even going to try and do the math. I'm just going to let fate decide. It was. <laughs> but the skin of our teeth, baby. I'm loving every minute of it, Jerry. Um, hmm. We will buy and use you. We like that cards. Allows us to turn things into other things. I am never mad about that. I'm going to get rid of that. That why the heck not um and then i don't know yes enhanced cards because we do kind of need enhanced cards to start making this work does it sell for it sells for two okay oh do 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 
So this would be... Let's go Mercury. Get that air up. Um, re-roll. Egg! Yeah, no, it might be a little late for egg. It might be a little late for egg. Oh, I... <laughs> we were about to scuff the run. Okay. I don't think we can do this, but we'll we'll try. Um, do a pair. See how this goes. Yeah, we're probably a little scuffed on it. One more hand to play. Hmm. Definitely need more hands. We'll see. We'll see if this is good enough. Just buy. Then what's this worth? It's worth four? Let's, uh, let's open a spectral pack. Out of all, no, see, so yeah, at this point, X is way too late. Um, a blue seal in hand wouldn't be bad, so I might do it. Do, 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 do. I'm just trying to see. We've got the money. We might as well try and uh, level up. Constellation as much as possible. It's really going. And use. And uh, yeah, this might this might be the end of the run. But this is this is a good video, man. We, we got we got far. I'm not too mad. Um. In, in a different world, in a different world, half Joker, you and I. Let's just go. Um, yeah, I think, you know what? If I only one hand type this round, as long as it's pairs, I think we'll be fine. What's our best hand? Our best hand type really is technically three of a kind. It's 130 times 13. The consistency of pulling that off compared to like high card. Can we, without discards? Yeah, it's hard. It's hard. Um, you're going to be worth four. Yes, eat the egg. <laughs> uh, so we'll do the ace with the king. Get rid of the king. 186. Yeah, we're not. We are not making it. I am sorry, folks. Uh, this will definitely be our last blind. Uh, but again, thank you guys for watching. I, I appreciate all the support with these videos. Uh, I've been enjoying our little chats. Didn't I know this one was more gameplay focused. I didn't really uh, do any banter. Um, but it's again, I was, you know, first time running this, kind of piloting this deck on camera uh, for you guys. So I kind of wanted to like walk through every step. I think it, it did well. It was just a suboptimal place probably. Um, but in that case, you know, things happen. But again, if you like this video, if you like my content, you know, you know what to do. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, leave a comment, tell me what you want to see. And also, you know, I don't know how much longer Balatro videos will go on for. Uh, I'm going to keep making them as long as I'm enjoying them. If there's other roguelike games that you want to see content on or others, please leave comments, give me ideas. Uh, you know, constructively, don't like be demanding. Don't be a type A chatter. Uh, I'm not Northern Lion. <laughs> I will shut you down. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching. Um, this is going to be our last hand. Didn't even come close. Oh, we got kind of close. Kind of close. Um, but yeah. Uh, yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you guys in the next video. And uh, have a great day.